just standing inside the mausoleum, there's definitely uh, an energy around the actual monument in the corner. This whole chapel here is dedicated to Lord Rich, who I believe was the first Baron Rich of Lees in Essex. And this is, although quite a plain mausoleum by some standards, is very, very interesting for its very rich, ornate carvings in the corner, which we're going to focus on a little bit more closely. I actually think it's one of the two Lord Riches who are interned here. There was the first Baron Rich who had this beautiful mausoleum built, and also that of his son. Yes, definitely an old man. Walks with a kind of gait. Yeah, sort of rolls on his hips. It's it's not unpleasant. It's um, it's quite gentle and also quite persuasive in a way. It sort of draws you to this rich, ornate carvings. I certainly feel a degree of pride, certainly. What if Baron Rich or his son would like to say something while I'm here? I mean, no offence. I'm just seeing a flash of energy in the far corner of the mausoleum by uh, an Edwardian wardrobe. It's just literally like a spurt of light. Just across here, actually. good aura or energy just in front of me. It's quite strong. I have to excuse other people in the church, unfortunately. I sat meditating for about 20 minutes, but unfortunately on review, no meaningful EVP was captured. A considerable amount of my time inside the church was occupied by videoing and of course taking digital still photographs. And before I go, a very strange event happened earlier that day whilst out on the street and setting up a camcorder. That was certainly worth the visit. There were certainly two energies very strongly in the mausoleum area 
and the overall atmosphere of the place that was prevailing felt quite pleasant. So it will be interesting to see exactly what's been captured, if any, but I've certainly hoped you've enjoyed the visit with me here today.